It's back with the Bargainer and I'm back with a organizing video. I'm in my kitchen here and I'm going to show you the organization that I have for uh, several of my things that I store. My spices, mixing bowls, uh, measuring spoons and cups, and my leftover container storage. I also at the end will show you um, how I store my towels and my washcloths or my dish cloths in my kitchen uh, using Dollar Tree. I'm going to show you my bins. favorite cabinet in my kitchen. And this is where I store all of our leftover containers and mixing bowls and serving bowls and spices. So let me just come on over here and show you what I have. Um, I just love this organization because um, I do use a lot of bins. I'll start on the bottom sure. here. I have these baskets from uh, Walmart. These are just little, um, these are good size baskets. I guess you would get them, you know, like for your desk or something. But these are nicer, longer and I put all my spices in them. The most used spices I put here and access quickly, these are like steak seasonings, things like that. I, I try to categorize them so I know where they are when I'm looking for them. I do salt and pepper here and then I have toothpicks. And then over here are the seasonings I don't use as much but they're there if I need them. And then over here I have measuring uh, cups and you know, liquid and dry. And then cinnamon is over there. And I do have room for other things there. I did line all my cabinets with this Dollar Tree liner. And it's really nice at the Dollar Tree. I think I used, I think I got this shelf done in one roll. So like one roll a shelf. So you do need to buy several rolls to do one cabinet. Um, okay, I'm going to show you this on the door. This is my husband's invention. <laughs> he put these hooks, these command hooks on the door for our dry measurement uh, cups and then also for our spoons. And um, so yeah, that's working out well and it's just easier to hang there. Then on this shelf, I lined it again with Dollar Tree liner. And uh, these are on the bottom here of the shelf. I have glass, uh, glass bowls. I usually use these for serving. And then there's a, um, you know, square baking dish above there. Then I have my metal bowls here and plastic bowls, which works out well. I think I have a couple of them missing right now. But And then up here on the top, I have these this organizer that I got from Goodwill. This organizer is mainly used for, like, cookie sheets. You could also use it for lids for your pots and pans, but I use it for these Pyrex dishes that I got from Target. They were having like a 20% off um, clearance or 20% off sale. So I got um, these Pyrex dishes. They're three cup size and we use these for our lunches to, you know, if we have leftovers, we just bring those. And then I have a large one there against the cabinet. But these fit in perfectly and they're um, they are glass, so you know I don't want them stacked, and um, it just looks really nice. So I, I got that organizer for I think it was a dollar ninety nine, and then over here I have these Dollar Tree bowls. Um, these are one cup bowls that I got at the Dollar Tree, and the lids are right there. And this other organizer that I purchased from Goodwill for ninety nine cents. This is perfect for like small lids, uh, you know. For I think originally you you would use it for pots and pans you know, pots and pans lids, but I use it for all my plastic, um, I mean my plastic lids, you know, for my glass dishes. My husband and I went through all of our plastic wear and got rid of most of it. Uh, we just kept some of the larger ones and then we got all glass uh, bowls and leftover containers and things, which has been working out really well. Uh, with exception of our salad dressing containers, we do, we do keep the salad dressing containers plastic. Uh, and these are all the lids that we have. Some of these lids go to, you know, um, these mixing bowls below and things. So I am missing a couple of these uh, Pyrex dishes there in the dishwasher, but this kind of shows you some organization that we've been using. And I really enjoy this cabinet. It stays organized. I don't have to keep reorganizing it. The system is working very well. I did get this uh, on the middle shelf. I did get that shelf there for the white shelf at, at home and um, it was in a set there so I hope you enjoyed this organization and if you have any organizing videos that you would like to see for me just let me know in the comments below and um, thank you so much for watching have a great day 
Here in my kitchen, I have this IKEA shelf that my husband and I purchased a couple years ago. I have all my cookbooks down there on the bottom. I have soda. And then in these two red baskets um, is where I store all of my towels and dish rags. And then just some decor here at the top.